Morning crew, coming at you for your Monday workout of the week. So we're gonna start off today with a five minute AMRAP for our warm up, just consisting of four movements and you're gonna rotate through smoothly. The first one is 10 air squats. So we're doing lots of squatting in today's workout. So just take your time, make sure your hips are warm and then you're getting full range of motion. You're then gonna grab either both your dumbbells or one dumbbell, it's up to you. And you're gonna go into 10 push press. Dip, drive, press up overhead. Try to find a nice rhythmic pattern here because this is gonna matter in the Metcon. Once you hit 10 of those, you put that down. We're gonna go into 10 lunges. These will be reverse lunges and stationary in one spot. Five reps per side. We're then gonna go into 10 easy push-ups. Easy is different for everybody, but full range of motion is what we're looking for. So chest touches the ground or the object, Elbows lock out at the top. Again, 10 reps. So you have five minutes on the clock. You rotate through those four movements smoothly. And then we're gonna jump into our Metcon for the day. So our Metcon is a pretty big one today. It used to be revered as one of the most difficult CrossFit workouts created. Uh, it has since uh, lost that title, but it's still an insanely difficult workout. So this is going to be a playoff of the Hero Wad Kalsu. We're going to set a clock, it's got a 20 minute timer, and you're going to complete 100 dumbbell hang thrusters. But, there's a caveat here, every minute you have to stop your dumbbell work and perform 5 burpees. So this workout is known as a downward spiral style workout, meaning that if you get super tired and beat up from the dumbbell work, <laughs> and the burpees take you a long time, you end up just kind of doing burpees in that minute and you don't actually get back to the dumbbells. So if that happens to you, we recommend you scaling back the number of uh, burpees to do in that minute so that you're able to get to these guys and you're not just doing burpees and not getting closer to the 100 reps. So a dumbbell hang thruster looks like so. I have the dumbbells at the side of my body. I'm gonna hinge over, come through extension, shrug, pull myself under, catch it at the bottom of the squat and press up. The full movement at full speed looks like this. So I'm going to perform 100 of those, but we have to set a clock. Every time that bell goes every 60 seconds, I got to perform five burpees. Chest touches the ground, stand up, and jump the pot above my head. Like so. We recommend at the beginning trying to uh, you know, knock off huge sets of these guys, um, but keep a little bit in the tank because we know that the burpees are going to knock you out too, guys. Okay, it's a 20 minute uh, time cap. Post your times in the comments, and we'll see you tomorrow.